It's shocking how far back we can go now with modern technology. I have helped to solve cases back into the 1950s. And so it really just depends on how well that sample has been stored over the years or decades. Familial DNA searching, or FDS, is a forensic technique using DNA databases like MyHeritage.com or 23andMe to identify the biological relatives of an unknown DNA sample. In John Bonet's case, it would seek to find possible relatives of the unidentified male DNA that was found on John Bonet's underwear and body. We point them towards someone who is a relative of all of these matches in the database or these partial matches, and then they have to collect DNA to test out that theory. A familial DNA search result is only a lead. Once the DNA can be traced down to potential suspects in a family tree, investigators use normal techniques to compare the suspect to the actual crime evidence and the facts of the case. It often requires gathering direct DNA from a suspect to match the actual sample from the crime scene. For cold cases like John Bonet, it can be an absolute game changer. The grim sleeper, the Golden State Killer, the boy in the box, the lady in the dunes, all solved using familial DNA tracing, sometimes using DNA samples as small as those left by a single touch.